How's it going, you guys? Welcome to another episode of Fishing with DJ Bassin. I'm here back at the place where I cut my knee. And yeah, Lake Columbia. So um, it's about 7 30. I'm waiting for my brother to show up. And we're gonna meet up here. We're gonna do some fishing. It's uh, it's cold. I wanna say it's about, I don't know, probably like 9, 5 aqua numbers. Uh, I don't know, 10 degrees or lower. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see behind me, but it's like so crazy here. Let me just peek you guys out very quick. You guys see that? Man, this lake is steaming. It's crazy. So, I don't know how long my GoPro is going to last. I'm going to do my best. Subscribers and followers have been saying, when am I going to catch some bass? I'm not really bassing bassing but you know we're here in wisconsin so um i'll do my best to catch whatever i can it's it's tough I'm really just waiting for someone to come you guys so i can just do more bass fishing videos but um what we're desperate is what we do you guys we drive two hours away to fish a lake to literally catch like one bass they're not even that big so yeah dude so yeah hopefully we do good stay tuned you guys all right, so my brother's taking a little too long. Let me find a spot fishing. Let's fish on shore here. I'm looking for shore anyway, but I'm just gonna flip a couple structures. See if I catch catch something here. It's how cold it is. I don't know if you guys just see the steam. It's pretty crazy. So I guess a lot of people fish right here. I haven't never really fished on this side, and um, I guess they gonna be dragging this. Striking, um, I don't know what this is, honestly, it's a flipping lure that I like to use. All I know is it's striking and it's awesome. So. It's so cold. At least it's not windy, you know? It's freaking cold. Ridiculous. Oh my gosh. My line is iced up already. I guess people caught some fish. I made a little ritual here. I think I got a hit. I just a bluegill. Or just a rock. Last chasm, go back inside. It's too cold. I, I gotta preserve my heat here. Some bluegills. All those big fish. Oh, we got, oh, I had a fish. I had a fish. You guys, you guys saw that. You guys saw that. Look. I just lost a, oh, a smallmouth. Darn. Lure destroyed. I just lost a fish, you guys. I, I'm sure it was a smallmouth. I'm put the speed crawl on. That was pretty cool. Alright, speed crawl. Let's see what you can do. I hear a lot of good things about you. Alright, so we made it to our destination. My brother Chow. Um, water seems frozen, shallow, but I'm gonna fish this side, okay? You guys, I promise you guys, I'm gonna see if I can catch a bass, a decent bass today. 
Like it's cold, you guys. I'm talking about 10 degrees, man. So, see what I can do here. And now with my GoPros, <clears throat> I can only record for so long, too. It's so cold. All right, so last time he caught it right here. So, let's see. I should never wear red. Bad idea. Oh, I got one! I got a fish! Whoa! It's a big one! Whoa! Whoa! I got him! Whoa! I got him! I got a smallmouth! Yeah! Whoa! You guys saw that? Oh my god, my speed crawl got destroyed! Where's Cass? Big in! Yo! Cow, dude, this guy's it's a good one. Oh, my glove. No, my speed crawl. Hold on. Hold on, you guys. Ugh. Off of a speed crawl, you guys. <laughs> this fish is so warm. We get a good recording here. No, that's awesome. Look at that, you guys. GoPro makes it seem small, but it's at least a, I don't know, two and a half, three pounder. Oh, the fish is so warm. Look at the belly in this thing. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and let it go. I'm gonna get a quick picture of my phone. All right, so I'm gonna let it go, you guys. Catch and release. Oh my goodness, this is the first cast. I'm gonna go, y'all. There he goes. Oh, that was awesome. Okay, take two. Let's go. This is a little tricky, you guys. Um, I like to stretch out my plastic a little bit, especially if it's not like the really salty kind. And um, just stretch it out, get some more action. As you guys can see, I'm using I'm ghetto rigging this. Uh, I got a uh, I don't know this a sinker, a pinch sinker, <laughs> and a bowler weight. You know. All right, let's see here. That was awesome. Probably scare the rest for all that screaming. Oh, there's the snake. That's that bad snake. That's that drop. Oh, it's gonna break. Yep, there he goes. There he goes. Look what I found. Thank you for the umbrella rig. Sweet. <laughs> Merry Christmas! This is so sketchy, you guys. Look at this. It's all ice. It's crazy to believe that the water was this high. Now I'm in a nibble. Alright, I'm good. Huh? Alright you guys, so as I'm editing this video, I'm sorry the GoPro died. It was so cold out, like I said, it was 10 degrees, my fingers were freezing, and that's all that I could get in my GoPro. Hopefully I didn't waste 10 minutes of your time. I do really appreciate you guys watching my videos. In this video, I'm using the Zoom Speed Crawl. Okay, you guys, this is my first time using this lure actually, you know, I, and I see it everywhere, all over YouTube, in the market. This is the brown and chartreuse color. Um, it's pretty cool. I mean, it worked, you know, like I said, it was my first time using it. And um, I happen to use it with the BMC Wide Gap. Uh, this is the three offset. So I like using the smaller profile like this, especially in the winter time here in Wisconsin. It's, it's crazy, okay, you guys, the temperature, the water temperature, temperature, weather, whatever. It's never consistent. So, uh, finesse is always the way to go during this time of the year. Again, thank you for watching my video, you guys. I really do appreciate you guys taking the time to watch my video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is uh, D. Yang Bassin. Until next time, fish on.